Hi, I'm Dominic Trapassi, Product Manager of Racks and Cable Management at the Data Communications Division of Legrand. I'm going to review the features and benefits of the flagship rack for Legrand, which is the Mighty Mo 20. So there's many different optional features on the Mighty Mo 20, which we'll get into, but I want to talk about the rack itself first. So there's two different versions. There's a four post rack and then there's a channel rack. Both of those are perfectly suited for uh, data communications types of locations as far as data centers, but also for telco rooms and smaller environments. So we'll talk about the channel rack. The channel rack is available in six and a half inches deep, all the way up to 30 inches deep. So it can be used now for both uh, network applications, but also for server and switch applications. Because of the depth up to 30 inches in what we're considering to be a two post rack, which we call the channel rack, in 30 inches deep, you can fit a network switch in that rack, but also put your network equipment. So if you're trying to consolidate your rack down to a single rack, so if you have multiple racks and you want to build all that equipment into a single rack, the Mighty Mo 20 is perfect for that. Not only is the Mighty Mo 20 available in six and a half inches deep all the way up to 30 inches deep, but it's also available in seven foot, eight foot, and nine foot versions. So we can extend that rack up to nine feet and get extra uh, rack space. So one of the really important features of the Mighty Mo 20 channel rack is this hex pattern. It's patented on the Mighty Mo 20, but what a lot of people don't realize, it's one of the most important features of the cable management system in general. This allows you to route cables inside of the rack, but also outside of the rack, and allows you to tie off those in infinite locations. So if you have five cable bundles or 10 cable bundles, you have infinite locations to tie those cable bundles off to the sidewall, whether they're external or internal. So the hex pattern also lends itself to accessories. These accessories all snap into this hex pattern. This is a universal cable trough which actually allows you to build a fiber uh, troughway on the side of the Mighty Mo 20, and you can twist this in an infinite uh, location so that you can route that fiber in any direction that you want. So this product right here is called the HexGuard. It allows you to bring cables from the inside of the rack to the outside of the rack. It has the proper bend radius for fiber as well as copper, and allows for 360 degrees of cable exit, so you can have your cables exit out the top or you can have the cables exit out the bottom. It has a snap fit feature, so they snap one side snaps into the internal side, the other half snap, snaps onto the external side, and they interlock together. So you can attach this to existing cable bundles, or you can attach this first and then route new cable bundles. One of the great features of the channels of the Mighty Mo 20 is this square pattern. This 3-8 square pattern allows for these types of accessories. This is a cable clamp accessory to go directly into the sidewall, twist lock into place, and then if you want to remove it and move it to a different location you can do that you don't deteriorate the mounting feature these also show up on the rear of the rack at the front of the rack and along the top so you can basically build your own cable management around the mighty mo 20. mighty mo 20 is available not only white but in black also and white is great for data center applications where we're trying to increase uh, visibility and allow for easier access to punch downs, so the brightness of the, the rack itself actually increases the visibility in the back of the rack. Mighty Mo 20 has RU uh, location markings, both front and rear. It has tick marks, so you can see each RU location. On the deeper versions, so the 24-inch and the 30-inch versions, it's actually marked on the inside. So if someone is trying to install a piece of equipment or a slide or a tray in the front, they'll be able to see the front marking as well as the back marking from the front side. Mighty Mo 20 has been UL load tested and certified to 2416 for 2,000 pounds static load. Also, it's been uh, certified for bonding and grounding per UL 2416. And the way that's done on the Mighty Mo 20 is via uh, invisible bonding tabs up above in the corners and down below in the corners. So when you assemble the Mighty Mo 20, it actually becomes bonded without any extra ground straps or star washes or paint removal at all. If you look up at the top in the back, and in the front, there's dual ground locations. So there's a ground location in the rear for a dual lug, a ground location in the front for a dual lug, which completely completes the uh, UL2416 certification. Mighty Mo 20 also has the tried and true Legrand waterfall, which allows cables to come from the network locations up above, down into the vertical managers, and then path, follow the path into the electronic equipment or into the patch panels. Mighty Mo 20 also incorporates the patented Legrand speed nut, which you can see here is a uh, molded plastic that has two nuts installed in it, allows you to assemble the rack without any loose hardware, and also allows it to be built as a one-person build. It uh, decreases the amount of time it takes to build a Mighty Mo 20.
Mighty Mo 20 Vertical Manager has a slam latch design on the doors, so it's very easy to open and close. You just push on the handle here, which is actually invisible while it's installed. Push on that handle, and you can open the Vertical Manager. Slam latch design means you don't have to close that latch again. Once you've closed the door and push on that door, you've closed it. It opens on both sides, so you get access to both sides, so you can dress cables in from the left-hand side and the right-hand side. Mighty Mo 20 Vertical Manager has a six inch deep finger, which is one of the largest in the industry, which translates into larger capacity vertical manager. This is only a six inch wide version. We have up to 16 inch wide version, which is the largest capacity in the industry. These fingers These have finger. an I-beam design, which gives them additional strength, but also gives them more flexibility. So you can basically twist these fingers without any risk of breaking them. Also gives them more strength down at the back here based on that I-beam design. Part of the byproduct of that I-beam design is it allows us to snap these bend limiting clips, which is 180 degrees of fiber bend limiting, onto those fingers. You can see one snapped into place right here, and there's no chance of crimping a fiber because we brought that up 180 degrees. The Legrand patented arrowhead design allows for cables to enter this passageway, but not come back out, so the stopper on the back of the arrowhead. You'll have multiple cable bundles come through here for each RU increment. These fingers line up with the RU increments, bring the cables through, and then they're encapsulated here. Inside the vertical manager, we can see we have these cable spools, which are removable, so you can move those into different locations. They snap right into place, and this will allow you to pull up any slack in your uh, copper or fiber cables. The frame itself of the vertical managers is made of a wire basket which by itself is part of the cable management. So you can tie off cable bundles to the back side of this vertical manager via the wire baskets. Another feature that was added to the Mighty Mo 20 vertical manager we learned from one of our customers. We had people that were standing on the vertical manager itself using this as a step. So we put a, a support bracket at the bottom. So now Another time-saving feature of the Mighty Mo 20 vertical managers is the spacer bar. As you can see, it tells you the size of the cage that you're going to put between two Mighty Mo 20s by at Installing this into the side of the Mighty Mo 20 here, you lock that into place, lock it into place on the other side of the opposing Mighty Mo 20, gives you the proper spacing for the vertical manager. What that allows you to do is build all your racks out and bolt them to the floor and then add your vertical managers later. Along that same line of time saving, we've added a hanger clip to the vertical manager so you don't have to bolt the vertical manager into place. You can hold it with the the hanger clip and then bolt it into place. You can see that hanger clip right there. In closing, Mighty Mo 20 is the flagship of the LeGrand product offering for cable management and racks. That is due to the fact that it is so versatile. It's got multiple sizes. It's got seven foot, eight foot, nine foot, and up to 30 inches deep. It has uh, two posts, which we call the channel rack, and four post racks, which are up to 42 inches deep.